Hey guys, it's Clara, and today I'm going to be doing a back-to-school clothing haul. I'm actually starting college this next um, this next year. I actually move in in less than a week, which is crazy. So before I start packing up all my clothes, I wanted to show you some things that I have picked up over the course of this. Now, normally I don't buy this many clothes for back to school, but since I um, in high school I had a uniform, and so now transitioning into college, I can't really wear khaki skirts every day. So I did pick up a few pieces. So this is a pretty massive haul. And normally I would want to do like a try on haul because I know those are really popular right now, but there were just so many pieces that it it didn't make any sense otherwise this video would be about two hours long. So I'm just going to hop right in and show you guys what I'm going to be taking with me to college. Okay, so I didn't really separate it by uh, store, I separated it by item, otherwise again it wouldn't really make any sense. So I'm going to start with shoes. These I've already worn like a bajillion times so they look kind of gross. But they're just some sandals that I got from Anthropology, and I've just been throwing them on this summer. Um, they're really easy, and I actually am going through Russian college, so I think these are going to be great walking house to house to keep my feet comfortable. And then I got these bad boys from Urban Outfitters. They were on sale for $89, and they're just Doc Martens, and they're in the shiny sort of plastic. I have a pair of like matte combat boots, so I didn't want to get another like matte pair, so I thought the shiny ones would be kind of fun so yeah that's what they look like and I'm super mm -hmm. pumped to wear these all the time now I'm gonna move into like pants skirts that kind of thing so the first thing I have is a skirt and a lot of this stuff I got from boutique so I'm just gonna give you the brand it's by the brand cling spelled with a K K L I N G and it's just a super high-waisted skirt like it honestly goes above my belly button by a lot and I just think it's really flattering it's really cute um yeah and I'm excited to wear this with blouses sweaters I'm gonna get a lot of use out of this year round then I got a pair of shorts and these are from Black Housewife Market and again I got these for Rush these are in a size two uh they run I found a little bag usually I'm like a four um, so they look like this and then I'm since they're pretty long I'm just gonna roll up the bottom like a layer because it's got the fabric but I think these will look great during rush they'll you know help me stand out etc and I just think I think these are really 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 cute then I got two pairs of chino shorts um, and I were I got ones that I knew I could wear in the fall I'm a huge fan of like their super bright colors but I thought these would make a little bit more sense um, so I got the three inch, I believe, uh, yeah, I think I got the three inch and I just got them in like a darker green color, which I can wear through the fall with like even tights and stuff if I wanted to. And I got this like camel color and I just think these are so cute. They're so easy and they're better than, you know, just throwing on Nike swords all the time. It makes you look a little bit more put together and I just think they're great. Then I got two pairs of jeans, both from Victoria's Secret. These are the Victoria's Secret high-rise jean. I love high-waisted jeans. The problem is like making sure they really, really fit you. I might have to get these taken in a little bit, but I love these. They're just kind of like a lighter, mm -hmm. lighter color of jean. So I got these, which are just, they're just easy. They're easy to wear, they're comfortable. I don't have to worry that, about my butt showing. And then I got a mid-rise in a really, the mid-rise siren in a really, really, really dark blue. And I just think dark blue is just a flattering, a flattering jean in general. So I am excited to wear those. And then before we move on to shirts and dresses, I just got some of the little breast petals um, that you can use if you're wearing like backless dresses, things like that. And I just think these are great to have. I just got them at a local boutique, but you can get them at Dillard Sacks pretty much anywhere. So now I'm going to hop into shirts that I got So the first thing I got was just like a little lace tank top I think these will be great for football games. It'll be great for going out to dinner It's just very versatile and I'm the kind of person that buys a lot of crop tops and things that aren't always the most practical to wear um, So this is by the brand Dainty Hooligan and it's just kind of this crimson red and I just think it's really flattering um, It's got pretty low sides so I'm going to have to wear with like a bralette or those little boob cover things that I showed you guys. But yeah, I just got a fun tank top that honestly I can carry into fall with like a leather jacket or an army jacket or really just, just anything. The next piece I got is 
from the brand Line and Dot. And if you guys haven't seen my back to school lookbook, I'll have it linked below. I, d I wore this shirt. I also wore that red tank. Um, and I just think this is a very classy looking shirt. It's just got a very classic cut. It's not too tight. It's not too loose. It's really flattering. Um, and I just love the shape. And I love blue because my eyes are blue. So I always convince myself it makes my eyes pop. And yeah, I just, I really like this shirt. And it was on sale too, which is always a plus. Then from Brandy Melville, I got a couple of things. First, I just got a good old halter top. And it's just got this really cool sunflower print on it. And I was a little uh, anxious, or not anxious, but a little apprehensive about buying a halter top because I just didn't think it looked very good. And it just seemed very old school. But on, I think it's really flattering with like high-waisted jeans, high-waisted shorts. Again, I can wear this through fall with like a leather jacket or something. So I just am super excited to wear that. And then also from Brandy Melville, I had to pick up a sweater. They hands down have my favorite sweaters. And I just got this really pretty army green sweater that I'll be able to wear this fall and then through this winter. And it's just really soft and I think it's really cute. And that's something I can tuck in with like that high-waisted skirt I showed you guys. And just, there's a lot of things I can do. Again, from Brandy Melville, I just got a super casual t-shirt that says New York. Um, I love New York. It's a fantastic place, but more importantly, I love this shirt. I just think it's super casual, it's comfortable, and it's got some a little graphic print going on, so I can kind of get my, my crop top print on a shirt that, you know, is long that I can wear with leggings, which is going to be fantastic. Oh, speaking of leggings, I also bought a pair of Lululemon leggings and I can't I can't find them currently so sorry <laughs> lastly from Brandy Melville I just got one of these Nadina tops which I think are awesome honestly I wanted to buy every Nadina top but I had to stop myself uh it's got string saying from it it's really flattering it's like just long enough um and it looks great again with high-waisted jeans shorts pretty much anything and I got it in black so again I can kind of wear it year-round then a shirt that I won't be able to wear year-round, but I like from the brand Mint is just this really awesome, like, bell sleeve top, and it is cropped, and I just think it's so pretty, and you can wear this with jeans or a skirt or shorts, and I just think it's really pretty and flowy, and it just makes you look a lot more dressed up, even if you're not. Then from Urban Outfitters, I just got from the brand Project Social Tea, made with love in Los Angeles. I just got this long sleeve v-neck ribbed tee and these I just like because they're easy, they're comfortable, um, but it's not just like a t-shirt so I look a little bit more put together. So I'm excited to wear that. And I also got, this is from the brand Dex, just a cool kind of tank top that I'll be able to wear for the rest of the summer and then it's got this like sheer blue in the back and I'm not usually a huge fan of high-low stuff but I think this is really just a cool top and I think it's pretty it's got the blue which I like and so I'm excited to wear that uh, these next two shirts are also from Urban Outfitters and this is by the brand Kimchi Blue and it was actually on sale and I got it in Boulder when I was in Colorado and it's just this super long like honestly you could wear this as a dress with tights like shirt that is a maroon color that I'll be able to wear in the fall um, and I just think it's it's really pretty and it's flowy, but it's not flowy like too flowy where it looks like you're not like you have no shape. So I'm excited to wear that with like tights or or jeans, leggings, etc. And then I also got kind of going on the red and blue trend, just kind of like a kind of like a baseball tee sort of. Um, and this is by the brand Color Fast Apparel, and I just think this is cool. You can honestly wear this with sh athletic shorts or leggings, jeans. It's just very versatile and it's a little more casual because let's be honest, I ain't gonna be trying most days on my way to class. Uh, moving on. This next shirt I actually got at a vintage store where they take like popular pieces from like places like Free People, etc., and they sell them for way cheaper. It's like kind of like off-season stuff. So this is by the brand 365. And it's a place called Goldmine Vintage, if you guys are wondering, in Boulder, Colorado. I'm Pearl Street and this is classified as new so they took it and it's it's not it hasn't been worn but it was in the vintage store and it's just like this really cute cropped daisy sweater which 
I am so excited to wear. I just think it's so cute. It adds a little pop of color, but it keeps the black going on because we all know I love my black. So I just think this is really cute. And again, these pieces you can wear with skirts, pants, leggings, pretty much whatever. This shirt I got just because I thought I needed something oops, along the lines of this for college. Like it's just a, like a nicer shirt. Um, obviously not something you're going to wear to like a party or things like that, but it's just a white button down by the brand Jack's Girlfriend, but Jack's is spelled J-A-C-H-S. And I actually think, yeah, um, and I really like it. And what I like about it is it's not just plain white. It's got the little gray uh, cuffs on the sleeves and the gray on the inside. So it's got a little flair to it. It's not just your everyday white Oxford, and I just think it's really cute. Um, and it's flattering and something nicer to wear if you have like a, a meeting or like a casual meeting or something or a presentation in class and you just want to look a little bit more put together. This next shirt is actually just by the brand Jack um, and it's just a really pretty sort of sheer teal um, button down and it's really loose so I'll be able to wear it in the summer and fall and in the spring of course and I just think it's really flattering again and it can just add a little bit of like flair to an outfit. You can even just like put a sweater over it and have the collar peeking through and that's just going to look really nice. Uh, this shirt I just fell in love with. It's from the men's section in American Apparel and it's just this cool color black tee. It's got like pink, purple, yellow, green and I just think it's so, so cool. And um, it's a, it fits a little bizarre just because it's so long but it's like looser and then it gets like tighter because I have a you know bigger butt so I might end up cutting it and kind of getting like a crop shirt going but either way I love this they it's just a really cool cool shirt to have in your wardrobe it'd be fun for like a retro kind of party or just like wearing on a daily basis which is what I like to do so I'm excited to wear that uh, this next shirt is by the brand District 91 I got it at a local boutique again it's just like a dark blue uh, kind of like a just chill shirt. Uh, it's not super exciting, but I like to have a lot of casual pieces because I know I'm not going to be dressing up that often. The only times I'll be really dressing up are like on the weekend. So I want to have like pieces that aren't just plain t-shirts, but aren't super like stiff and fancy, you know? Then I got this shirt and it is the brand Joe's and it's just like a big old sweater and it's just so comfortable and I probably won't wear this for a while since it's like a million degrees out currently but it's just really comfortable it's like kind of like the Henley tops and it's so soft and I'm just gonna wear this all winter long and then the last shirt before we move into dresses I know that's you're like how many shirts could you possibly buy apparently a lot it's just this beautiful 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 um, green like lace top and I just think it's so different than anything I own and like it just oh, I just think it's so pretty it's by the brand Audrey and I just think this is gonna look so nice it kind of peekaboos a little bit in the back and I just think it's such a pretty dress or shirt and it's just gonna look so classy with like whatever I wear so now let's move on to dresses <sighs> Okay, so last but not least is dresses. Thankfully, I did not do as much uh, damage with the dresses, but I did get a few that I figured I could wear during rush or date part, just things throughout the year. Um, just very versatile dresses. They're definitely a lot more colorful for the most part than I'm used to, but I'm super excited to wear them. So the first one is just a shift dress, and it's purple and pink threading, and I just think it's so like hip and cool, and it's just different than anything. I would expect it's by the brand Loved Rich or Love Rich, Love Rich, I guess, I don't know. And I just think it's really fun. I love shift dresses. I think they're really fun when you're just hanging out with, you know, girls going out to dinner, wearing with like some tall wedges. And I just think it's a great dress and to have. And you can eat as much as you want and nobody can tell because it's a shift dress. So it's like a win-win situation. This next dress is from American, nope, it's from Urban Outfitters. It's the Pins and Needles brand. It's not my favorite. It's a little short on me. But it's just like a fun little strapless floral dress. 
um, which you also saw in my back to school lookbook. And I think it's really cute. I wish it were a little bit longer so I could wear it to more places, but it's definitely fun in the summer, just like going out to lunch, going shopping, just pretty casual. Then I got a white dress because I was told a white dress is a must have in college. And I have, you know, a shorter kind of cocktail one, but I wanted one that was a little more modest. So I got this one, which is from the brand Hyper, H-Y-P-R. And it just looks like this. And it has this up top. And then actually, like, it has a little tiny layer of, like, see-through mesh right here. And then it continues down. It's actually pretty long. It hits right above the knee. Um, and then it kind of opens in the back. And it just, it's a very pretty dress. Um, and I'm excited. I'm excited to wear this. It's a lot more modest. And it's not super tight or anything. So it's just going to look really nice. And college. And my last two dresses are like crazy colorful and they're both from Urban Outfitters. You're like, what Clara color what? But I went for it. So this one is by the brand Cooperative and it was actually on sale, which is awesome. And it's just this beautiful pink sort of mini dress. And it's got like scalloping here and scalloping here. And I just think it's really pretty and really flattering. And I'm so excited to wear it. I don't normally ever wear pink, but I think I'm going to have a lot of fun with this one. And then keeping on the pink trend, this one is by the brand Oh My Love. Um, and it's just this dusty pink skater dress. And I love skater dresses. I think they're so flattering. And it's got this super high neck, which is really in right now. But the fun part is that it's completely backless. So it's just really pretty and I think this is going to look so cool with my combat boots and like an army jacket or something and I'm just super pumped like, to wear this um it's like probably my favorite for just out of everything so that's my back to school clothing haul I'm sorry it was about a million years long comment below with what you're getting for back to school subscribe if you haven't already and I will talk to you guys very soon bye